What's up YouTube? I'm Yasmin Woodland and welcome back to my channel. So today I will be talking about David Eason and this entire situation involving him actually making handmade tools like handmade knives, handmade knives, handmade everything. Um, so without further ado, let's get into this entire situation because a lot of people have been saying that he's actually illegally selling them, especially like illegally selling them like overseas. So if you all don't know, David Eason, he is um, he is a welder by trade and he actually has like this um, online store called like Black Metal and Wood, Black River Metal and Wood. And it's like a woodworking type business to where he has like an Instagram for it. He has like a Facebook and stuff like that. Now, he said that he created a Etsy account. Etsy is a place to where you can pretty much um, sell things, you can buy things and stuff like that. It's a pretty neat website. I've never purchased from Etsy, but I've seen some cute, cute stuff from people and I really wanna check it out and like buy something for myself. But in regards to David Eason, it seems to me that he actually makes like these tools and stuff like that. He makes knives, he, make, he makes like leather, uh, bracelets um if you will there's been a lot of people who've been saying that these bracelets that he's making is actually bought like he purchases them and he um they're like pre-made pretty much and he's just slapping his own brand on there saying that he did it but i, I don't know I, I have no proof of that but this is an Instagram post of him actually showing off some sort of weapon, some sort of tool, and he said that he actually has shipped it out uh, to a person that was overseas in Germany. Now, if you all don't know, David Easton lives, you know, stateside. I, I believe it's North Carolina is where he lives, so him and Janelle. And he said that his package mysteriously went missing in the mail and the person actually never received that uh that tool so he said he had to give that person a full refund and he was super upset about it now i don't know about you all but isn't it kind of strange how he makes like this weapon this tool that looks extremely dangerous and he actually ships it and the package goes missing. Isn't that crazy? I, I, my guess is that it probably got flagged because to my knowledge, I don't think you're allowed to sell stuff like that on Etsy. Like, I don't think you're allowed to, um, ship tools like that or, sh or ship weapons like that especially overseas like that i feel like that has to be some sort of legality there i feel like his package probably was uh flagged because if you all don't know sorry there's like a freaking bug but if you all don't know i do giveaways on my channel all the time and there's been times to where i've given away like my ipsy bags and my birch boxes and there's been times to where i had to actually take stuff out because it's like flammable it's like either like nail polish or something like that and when you know, when I go to the post office to ship it they're like do you have any flammables do you have any weapons do you have this this and this and this and if those items are on the list of prohibited items then you can't ship those items so I think it's kind of crazy how he is able to even ship these weapons especially overseas like that's super dangerous to me so i have no idea what david eason is doing um he sells all sorts of stuff from what is it i saw something with like deer legs on it and he made an he made it into like noon chucks or whatever you call it the things that you swing around your freaking head and stuff like that he sells all that stuff too and i'm just like i don't think you're allowed to do that so this is a, i mean I'm, i remember i saw a screenshot from like etsy and it was their policy saying prohibited items and stuff that you're not allowed to sell so it probably got flagged in the mail david it's probably not lost they probably took it out of the mail like hey you can't um you can't ship stuff like this like are you crazy so wow what do you all think about this situation involving david eason potentially selling illegal things overseas and stateside do you think this is illegal if you find anything online um in regards to like selling weapons making weapons and selling them overseas and stuff like that let me know because i'm pretty sure you're not allowed to do that and i'll do my own research as well so 
that's the tea for uh, today in regards to crazy, crazy David Easton. Why don't he just get a real welding job since he's a welder by trade, right? <sighs> Whatever. Thank you all for tuning in. I'm Yasmin Woodland. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button and tap the bell beside it to get notifications on whenever I upload so you don't miss out on any tea that I spill here on my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in. And until next time, see ya.